So hi friends, the topic of this particular video is like means how we can solve this double tab, double active tab that is being that is coming whenever we are using router link active. So let's first understand how the problem looks and what is the problem actually. Then we can proceed with the solution of this particular thing. So first, uh, like whenever we are clicking on this home button, then it's making this particular tab as active. What does active means from here? We can see the background is red. So we can consider this tab is active and it will tell the user that uh, you are in the home component or home page, what we can see in the normal language. If you're clicking in the contacts, it's loading the contact contact page. But the problem is like it's not it's making the home also as active so it will uh, it will create a confusion to the user like which tab right now we are we have click on the product product page is also loaded but still we have active tab as a home so let's see what the code is and then we can proceed with the solution of this one so if you can see this router link active what does it means it means like whenever we are on that particular path or uh, that component is open so that will going to make that particular uh, li means list item as an active one so active one is a class that i have made whose background is red the background that you are seeing here that is coming from this active one class so we have this router link that for the home it's a only slash and then for the about us we have a router link as a about contact and product if you can go with the routing model so here we can see for the home component it's a blank and for the other three we have about product and contact so let's understand actually what is the problem and why we are having these two tab as active so if you can see the url of this one so if you can see the url of home button it's like this one as we have kept in the router link uh, routing model the, uh, it will be empty then we need to open the home button because of that it's the url is like that only and for the product we have this url so if you can notice the there is a common in the product uh, url and the home so because of this only and if you open the contact and about also, uh, they will also have a same kind kind of url which which is because of this only because of this only home is always active because the part of the url is contained by other other list item also so if we want to resolve this we, we want to tell the angular so that like means we will tell the uh, angular that just make this particular uh, list item active only when it match with the exit url like means if the url is exit like this one if it's the url is uh, like this one only then only make this home as active so to uh, to do that particular thing we have a uh, one directive i can say that is router link active option and here we need to provide one parameter like exact true what does exact true means if it's match with this particular url then only it is going to make made it as a active so uh, we need do, do we need to apply the same thing to other also no we don't need to because if you can see the path of the about it will not match with anyone but if in case we have a url like something like this about slash abc and then at that particular time we need to append the same thing in the about also but as of now we don't have uh, url something like this about and after that one so we need to remove this one and just keep that particular thing on the home only so let's save this code and just see how it's behaving in the ui so now if you can see home button is loaded and then okay i think it's a spelling mistake i think s is also there in the router link active option will be there for this one 
now let's back to the ui part and then if you can see if i'm clicking on home it's coming as a home if it's about then it's coming as a about contact and then our product so this is the way like we if you want to tell the means it should match with the exact path so that's it from this particular video thank you for watching